Welcome to another video from Dr. Lock. We're going to look at a V-dub key here. Now these keys are used widely on Volkswagen V-dubs. They might even be used on some of the, the other cars which are very similar. Like I think uh, Lamborghini has the same same type of uh, key, well not sorry, same type of key blade and the systems are whatnot similar and you might find it on other cars as well. So this particular remote here, you see this is a genuine one and you can tell by all the details on the inside there. To get to the battery on this particular remote it's this bottom half here that we have to remove. So to do that most of the time you can do it quite easily it's just paper, you can do it quite easily just by grabbing it in your hands and pushing up just like so. It has little lunks that actually lock it back in place and you do want those lunks not to be broken if at all because you don't want your remote or the, your battery falling out. A lot of people slam have, have slammed their keys or remotes in car doors and what happens is that all of these little clips, the battery, sometimes even the transponder all go flying. So best to keep it as, as good and as clean and as tight as you can because often dust, dirt, sweat, moisture, if it gets into your remote control you're going to be stuck. So this particular one here is a CR2032 Panasonic 3 volt battery. Buy the best battery you can, you don't want to have to re keep replacing it and you don't want it to break down on you when you least expect it. So this is for a Volkswagen, you'll probably find it's very similar to a lot of other cars. Uh, the battery to replace it, you just get a little tiny flat blade screwdriver, you remove it, pops out and then what you might notice here is there's a big positive right here there's a positive symbol here which means that the positives goes up the way these batteries work is there's one surface and then this this edge and this top bit is the other surface so it makes contact with the side here with these two little uh, claws and at the base there it makes contact with this part here which is protruding up so we simply just pop that back in there pop a new battery in, put the lid back on, line it up the best we can, squeeze it together and we are good to go. Replacing a battery on a Volkswagen. Thanks for watching.